This is breaking news. Raves for Mia on American Idol. Get to know the New York singer from Fort Myers, Florida. The American Idol judges love Nye. They've raved about the former Southwest Florida singer every time she's appeared on the show, starting with her February 25 audition. You are actually a massive singer, Judge Luke Bryan told her after her audition. A massive personality. Lionel Richie agreed and offered this prediction for Nya. What you have are the goods, I think, to go all the way. Will it happen? That's up to America to decide. Now that live voting has started on American Idol, Nya. The stage name for singer-actor-dancer Nat Hamba Muchai Kenya made it through the American Idol auditions and then survived what Judge Katy Perry called the biggest and the toughest cut in Idol history. More than 140 singers entered the new Idol arena on the show's March 31 episode. Only 56 made it to the next round, including Naya. Naya has never identified herself on the show as a former Fort Myers resident, but she grew up here and now lives in Manhattan. It's unclear if she was born in Florida or Kenya, however. Previous episodes suggested she was born in Kenya, but on the April 14 show, Nia said this, My family came here from Kenya. My mom and dad weren't together by the time I was born. Naya hasn't been made available for interviews through an American Idol publicist. She's been busy in production, the publicist said. But Naya has deep connections to Fort Myers. She attended Fort Myers schools Orangewood Elementary and Cypress Lake High and her former vocal teachers at both schools remember her well. Willie Sparrow, her vocal teacher at Orangewood, watched her American Idol audition and says he felt extremely proud. Like Lionel Richie, Sparrow thinks his former student has what it takes to win Idol. Then again, he's always known she could make it big. Ever since she sang at Orangewood, I knew when I first heard her open her mouth, he says, Wow kid, you're going to be doing some great stuff. Naya performs on Broadway and Off-Broadway, including recent shows Titanic and Carolina or Change. She moved to New York City before her 21st birthday to pursue a career on stage, she told the New York Post. Before that, she studied law in Tennessee. That's what my family wanted me to do, she told the Post. I'm super Kenyan, super conservative family upbringing. Nye has no formal musical training, but she taught herself to sing, dance, and play six instruments. She sees American Idol and the top 24 as a defining moment in her musical career. If I can make that, she said on the show, then I feel like my career is about to be set right now. Her parents, however, haven't always been happy with her musical career. My parents didn't want me to do any of those things, she told The Post. They wouldn't pay for it. If it's not academics, it doesn't make any sense. Naya attended Cypress Lake High Center for the Arts and sang for the school's award-winning vocal group tag, the A Cappella Group. She was even nominated for the National CRA's Contemporary A Cappella Recording Awards for her solo on a 2011 TAD album. She was amazing, says Gary Stroh, her former vocal teacher at Cypress Lake High. She had that it quality. Naya is the latest former TAG singer to appear on American Idol or The Voice. The shows have also featured TAG alumni Casey Bishop, Rilly Plank, and Vonsel Baby V. Solomon. He's not surprised that his former student made it all the way to Idol, though. She impressed everyone who heard her at Cypress Lake High. Stroh recognized that same talent on display when he watched Nia's February audition on Idol. She had that spark like when she was here, he says, and that voice, and those riffs and runs. American Idol airs at 8 p.m. Sundays and Mondays on ABC. It also streams on Hulu. To vote, visit idolvote.act.com or the American Idol app. You can vote up to 10 times for each contestant. You can also text the contestant's number to 21,523. Nia's number is currently 6.